disappointing. Well, may I help you? Well, if you're Angela Bauer, I'm here to help you. I beg your pardon. I'm Tony Maselli. I'm here about the job. Oh, I'm sorry. There must be a mistake. This job is for a housekeeper. That's me, Mr. Goodmop. <laughs> uh, well, uh, my mother's screening everyone. Did you meet her? Yeah, yeah, yesterday. Uh, you know, she gave me the once-over, kicked me in the tires, put me up on a rack. Uh, well, she should have checked under your hood, because you're the wrong sex. Oh, <laughs> wait a minute. She said that wouldn't be any problem. My mother didn't think World War II was a problem. <laughs> oh, that must be Jonathan. Yeah. Cute kid. Yes, he is. You must be Jonathan. That's right. How'd you know? Now, uh, your grandmother told me. You're king of the reptiles, right? That's me! Hey. Excuse me. I'm in a terrible rush. I've got to get Jonathan to school, and I've got to catch a train. Well, I could take him. No, no. Jonathan, didn't I tell you to take the snake out of the living room? Not today, you didn't. <laughs> must you be so literal? Yes. Jonathan, I don't know what to uh, do with you. Uh, hey, Jonathan, why don't you uh, hustle your little buddy upstairs? Well, the big deal is it looks like a showdown between your snake and your mother. And remember, the snake doesn't pay your allowance. Good point. <laughs> well, sorry, Wilbur. Money talks and you don't. Th thank you. Uh, wh uh, where were we? Oh, yes. You were at the door and I was about to close it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I, you know, I gave up my apartment. I drove all the way up here. Your mother said I had this job, except for a small formality. What formality? You saying yes. No. Can we talk? <laughs> well, do, you, do you have any references? No. Do you have any experience? None. How many jobs have you had as a housekeeper? One, if I get this. <laughs> ah, Mr. Maselli. Here you are, and right on time. What a reliable person. <laughs> so, how are things going with you two? In the direction of the door. The door? Uh, Angela, what is the problem? The problem is, Mother, you sent me a man for a housekeeper. Oh, don't be sexist. A man can do meaningless, unproductive work just as well as a woman. <laughs> Mother, mother, the housekeeper's room is very close to mine. Oh, hey, don't worry about me. I keep a can of mace by my bed. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a sense of humor. <laughs> a regular Henny Youngman. <laughs> what a zany guy. Nevertheless, it doesn't look right or feel right for a man to be living here alone. But he's not alone. I... Didn't you tell her about Samantha? Well, You're married? Oh, no, no. Uh, Sam's my daughter. Uh... You're gonna love her. She's out in the truck. I'll go get her. No! No, wait! Well, isn't he perfect? No. He loves children, Angela. And children love him. I got that from the director of the Brooklyn Y. See, my instincts tell me this is the man for my grandson. And it doesn't hurt that he's a hunk. Mother. <laughs> I'm not looking for a hunk for a housekeeper. Why not? He'll do floors. He lift furniture. Can I come over when he lifts? <laughs> Mother, I don't know anything about this man. Now, Angela, I checked him out thoroughly, and it's a story you won't believe. Oh, one of those. I got it from his parish priest. See, he's an ex-jock, and he played in the major leagues for a while until he got hurt, and then they dumped him. The swine. <laughs> And it was just about that time that his young wife died. Mother, don't do this to me. They were childhood sweethearts, Angela. And since that time, well, he's been working at odd jobs. You know, a, a young widower, trying to find himself and support his little girl. You did it to me. <laughs> Angela, even the child psychologist said that Jonathan has to have a male role model. And this Tony. Is he male or is he male? I mean, we are talking mucho macho here. Oh, here she is. This is Samantha. Oh, oh, she got that shiner stealing third in Little League. Now, uh, Sam, I want you to meet some real nice people. This is Mona Robinson. Nice to meet you. And this is Angela Bauer. Oh, I'm very pleased to meet you, Miss Bauer. You have a lovely home and you're so pretty. Oh, thank you. I'm very flattered. That's the idea. <laughs> 